Woodyard driving on O'Connor, takes it right to him, and he ties the game. Trey Woodyard's played aggressive all year, taken to the rack. There's a Yinde Hakeem. They throw two Wildcats at him, gets rid of it to Mincy, and he nails a corner three. Takes Mincy into the paint. Moore forces up a floater and gets it to go. Christian Moore can score, partner. Max Brooks back into the game. And you weren't surprised, Coach, to see him taken out after five minutes as a catch-and-shoot three from Baker is perfect. The three-point maker, just what they needed off the bench. Game. He came in for Max Brooks, and now a catch-and-shoot three from Daniels goes. O'Connor with a ball fake. Look at the defense from Amon Robinson. Ahead to Woodyard. And one. What a play for the Wildcats. Robinson skips one over to Sunderland, foot on the line, knocks it down for two. Got to feel good. And forced 11 low giveaways. O'Connor stays aggressive and one. And they're going to need that down the stretch to stay in front. Forced to pass inside, and Hakeem is there to take it away. Rare turnover for Woodyard. Good vision up court, and Morris puts it through. Swatted away by O'Connor. UMass Lowell has ramped up the defensive intensity. For O'Connor, he's taken over the game. Miller went down this time. O'Connor gets loose and buries a three. A career high 21 points for Braden O'Connor. That time, McKean might have been better off just going to the rim himself, partner. He had the angle. That's what Robinson does, and it pays off for two. He's fearless. Overs, and now Hakeem lost the handle. Over the top for Daniels. Touchdown, Wildcats. Got 13 second half points. They're going to need a few more to come back in this one. Brooks, the two hand slam. Here, as Moore pulls up for three. And the UMass Lowell River Hawks come into Durham, New Hampshire, and get an 82 75 win to start the American East schedule.